at ringside are Daniel Sandoval, Timothy Hicks, Jonathan Davis. And when the bell rings, your referee in charge is Ivan Guillermo. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He's wearing silver trim with black. He officially weighed in at 149 and one half pounds. He is a 12 fight veteran with four wins, seven defeats, one draw, and two wins coming by way of knockout. De Cancun, Quintana Roo, Mexico. Please welcome Rodrigo Loving Boy Solis. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He's wearing gold with white. He officially weighed in at 146 and one half pounds. His professional record is perfect. Three wins, no defeats. All three wins coming by way of knockout. Fighting out of him, representing the LBC. Long Beach, California, please welcome Tyrell Dirty Love Washington. And here to give him final instructions is referee Ivan Guillermo. He received instructions to lock him. shoulders are good. Touch gloves, come on, fighting. That's referee Ivan Guillermo getting ready to call this one. Welcome to Marvin Nation. Boxing from Pico Rivera Sports Arena. I'm Beto Duran alongside 2012 Olympian, former world champion Joseph Diaz Jr. We're here with you. Nine fights coming your way in Pico Rivera Sports Arena. There are four bandas on the schedule. There are nine fights and this one could be quick. Tyrell Washington, Jojo, the lefty, the tall man out of Long Beach is Exciting. He has a good social media following. You know he's legit in social media because he's got a second account for Dylan Oh, wow. Oh, I just shot immediately. And he comes in quick, dirty left. Thank you for everybody to join us on Fight Hub TV. See the comments. And man, you just love the community. We're giving you free fights. You're like, where they at? Where they at? I'm telling you, go get another beer. Enjoy it. Hang out with him. Like your boy Tyrell Washington, 562. Uh, and also, shout out to Marco Villegas uh, setting us up on Fight Hub TV. So leave the comments. We'll check everything out with you guys. Nine fights coming your way. This one at 147 pounds. And it's scheduled for four rounds. His opponent, Rodrigo Solis, loving boy from Cancun, eating the left. As a solid left hand straight, straight down the pipe. How you been, Jojo? Everything's been good, man. Just uh, starting training camp, getting ready for this big fight that I got ahead of me. Can't say it against Ooh. who yet, because it's not official yet, so don't be asking what oh. or anything like that. Oh, he but caught a good scrap right here. As Solis, loving boy, is letting his hands go a little bit. So is there going to see any much technique in this fight? Nah, they're going to let it go. That's the thing about these fights, man. They're always exciting because you never know what's going to happen. Yeah. And Jesus M, is the whole card being shown? Yes, nine fights. This is the first one, the first round. And Pico Rivera Sports Arena, this is where uh, they're literally the horses are right next to us. Uh, the bull ring, that's where you're fighting at. So it's going to be fun. Uh, are you going to hear some people cursing in the background? Yes, because there's a lot of drinking going on. Jojo, you haven't fought in these kind of environments, but you've been to these kind of shows. This is like the nitty gritty, the real deal fighters, right? Guys trying to get to your level. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, these fights are pretty wild. I just went to the Quiet Canyon and seen some fights oh, there you? too. Yeah, they're pretty crazy. They're always exciting, man, because you never know what's going to happen. The club shows. The you know, club shows, that's right. The, you know, the QC, Tom Loffler, 360 Promotions, put that on. Uh, before your time, Jojo, QC's used to be the club spot. Albert Nick Baker from under the hand ramps. He knows about QC's. <laughs> so imagine that ballroom where they had the fights. Yeah. That was the club. And you want to see some good fights? Parking lot afterwards, man. Everybody was always getting oh, down. Oh, man. <laughs> Early 2000s, when you were in elementary. Were you one of them? I, I, dude, I was inside, and as soon as the fights were there, you know me. That's when I knew I wanted to be an announcer, because I would announce the fights in the parking <laughs> lot. <laughs> Back to the roots. 
<laughs> a good fight here, Tyrell Washington, Rodrigo Solis. Who will be seeing on the card later on? There's a kid in the third fight named Tito Mercado. I like him a lot in Nicaragua. Okay. Uh, and then after that, Maricela Cornejo. Yeah, we all know her. And then uh, Pimpo and Reyes from West, uh, Westside Boxing. And Jaffet Lamido will be pretty good. And Tenochi Lanama, Rudy Garcia, I came South Central. And then Adelia Ruiz, and you see some replays. And Joe, you said it, guys just scrapping. Yeah, I think uh, Terrell, he should be uh, dictating to the body a little more, man. Uh, just to try to break down Solis. Solis seems like he's a, a little trying to be aggressive and he's just trying to knock him out. I think what uh, Terrell should do is just, you know, keep his composure, dictate to the body, uh, use his range because he has a lot of range and a lot of advantage. Of, of distance against this guy Rodrigo. So I would like to see him keep his distance a little more, throwing straight left hand to the body and setting him up to have a straight left hand on top. Yeah, the taller fighter. And Tyrell has been coming in, just knocking people out. So he's not used to much resistance. And you know, you fought these guys, those tough Mexican dudes that have nothing to lose, and they don't know that they're supposed to lose. Yes, yeah. <laughs> they always want to get the upset. Yeah, they have that weird attitude. To fight him. Oh, Tyrell eats a left and a right. Rodrigo Solis, it's only scheduled for four, and he's coming to swing. Got to keep tight, man. Tyrell got to keep cut tight. Southpaw stands is Tyrell Washington. You can see the foul that Tyrell is doing. Uh, whenever he's stepping back, he's dropping his right Ooh, hand. Oh, he blow. just a low blow. That was extremely low. He, he's from Cancun. That might have been in Brazil, man. Wow. Wow, that was. He's gonna get the five minutes. Ivan Guillermo, referee, walking over to Tyrell Washington. And it looks like Rodrigo Solito, he stood up, and he's like, no, 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 not yet. You ever been hit like that, Jordan? Uh, in sparring, man, in town, it's not, it don't feel right. What do you, what, are his very, legs, very what do his legs feel like right now? It's not his legs, man. It's his stomach. So, oh. yeah, when you when you get hit right there, it's just, it travels all the way up to your stomach and it goes down to like your throat, man. You need to throw up. That throw up feeling, like when you're hungover, not you would be hungover, but I'm saying me, the writers, like that feeling of like, you, you like on like stomach flu or something like that? Exactly. That's how it feels. Uh, yeah. Ew. And it's like just aching pain. They touch gloves in the middle. He could have used five minutes, didn't use them. So Rodrigo Solis. This is the second round, our first bout of the night. Tyrogi, looking for the big knockout. Yeah, he is, man, because he's, like you said, he's used to knocking everybody out. So now that he has someone that is challenging and that could take his punch, he's getting a little bit, uh, he's getting a little bit too hesitant. And um, I feel like he's getting a little too wild. He's dropping his hands. When he's pulling back, he's dropping his right hand. And, um, he could get caught with any shot. That's how he's been getting hit. Those hooks.
dropping his right hand. He's dropping his right hand. Put See the replays, Jojo. So that was a low blow. I think uh, Terrell knew that he was kind of a little hurt, so he wanted to throw a shot like that so he could, you know, catch himself. Was kind of been intentional. Yeah, I think it was intentional. Oh, you, oh, you know what? Yeah, on that angle. Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> I'm trying to give him the benefit of the doubt, but not from that angle. Wow. He dug deep. Third round, and it's a battle. As Tyrell Washington, who's had it easy in his young career. I wonder if his legs are still good now to see. He's been getting tagged by the veteran Rodrigo Solis. If I was Solis, I would just go after him right now. Just jump on him right now? Just jump on him right now. So he had him hurt like literally 10 seconds, not even not even two minutes. So he's still kind of a little wobble. So Solis' record, he's got seven losses, right, Jojo? So it's misleading. The last five losses, the last three guys that he fought were all undefeated. He went the distance. His, oh. his last fight with Mark Dawson was a draw, and Dawson was undefeated. And the two fights before that, Jean Rivera was 6-1, and one, Berwin Beron, 9-1. So he's the guy who was taking on the young prospects and giving them trouble. Yeah, you can tell by, by his awkwardness, he looks a little strong, too. That's some pretty decent pot. And you know dudes like Solis, when they come to the United States, it's like, wait, I can fight here? I don't want to be the opponent, but if I upset somebody, all of a sudden his record is five and seven instead of four and eight, and the commission makes it too different. Jojo, do you run at Pomona High? Yes, I do. All right, so there you go, Crip. Asking your Jojo River to come on a high. There it is. Why he asked me? Yeah. Asked yeah. So we're live on YouTube and people can leave comments. So we see them. And so these lands are the left. He's dazed right now. He's dazed. Man. He's hurt. And he's oh. coming after him. Good body, good body work. Good body work. So he's that's that experience right there, breaking them, breaking them down to the body. And he's been in these deep waters. Tenochtitlan so Lava will be your seventh fight tonight, Brandon J. Did you guys leave the comments? Oh, good shot. Oh, good one from the left. <laughs> but he's on the isn't he? Yeah. You can tell he's because he's hurt, so his body's not there anymore. This is a tough Mexican in Pico Rivera. The favorite would be the undefeated Tyrell Washington, who has a crew with him tonight. He has his own photographer, he's got his own videographer. And he's breathing heavy right now, JoJo. It's time about Washington. He's taking him to a place he's never been before, man. And this is this is where you gotta dig deep and you gotta realize all the training that he did, all the sacrifice, man. You gotta just find that find that way to adapt and just adjust, man. If I was if I was Terrell, I, I wouldn't be trying to exchange with him now, knowing that he can't hurt this guy. Um, and this guy has hurt Terrell already multiple times. I think that he should fight a smarter game plan by using his distance, keeping his jab, and just fighting smart, and just trying to get this done. Oh, that bad. That's like the best punch of the night for Tyrell Washington. It's only scheduled for four rounds. It's Solis doing up. Thank you for joining us tonight. Marv Nation presents. This is the second time that Marv Nation has done a show here in Pico Rivera. Uh, you see the blue carpet on the ground because underneath us is the dirt. We're literally in the bull ring. And you got a couple of bulls getting after it. A cool setup, cool event. We did a media event on uh, Wednesday. And I think you were honored, right? Oh, your father was honored. My father was honored with the That's WBC awesome. belt, man. After all these years we've been putting in, uh, he deserves it. Uh, my success is not just me, it's my whole team, my father, my Ben Lira, everybody that has been uh, with me through, uh, through everything, man, through day one. So um, my father, he's, he's been there since I was 13 years old, believing in me and just making me try, try to be better, and I appreciate him for everything. He's the one that took you to that gym when you thought you were a baseball player. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, that's Good right. And, and of course, this is this is a shout out to your mother, Barbara. backbone of the family. Always there. Never talks, but she sees everything. She sees everything. She's very observant. Yeah. 
Fourth and final round, Rodrigo Solis from Cancun, the Mexican. Tyrell is it low again. Oh! He dropped him, not to slip. It's a slip. Ivan Guillermo, the referee, jumped in right away. He almost landed it though. And you can tell that Solis knows that, hey, I am not the favorite here with his attitude. Huh? Yeah, but so far I think he's won two rounds, so it should be a draw already. I think uh, oh, he, has he, to drop a he has to drop him right here in order to win the fight. See, normally those shots that Terrell lands knock his opponents out. Yeah, they're going to they're gonna minus a point from him once. Those shots that Terrell lands normally knock him out. This time, Solis is eating. Looking at him. He's been warning both of them. That one didn't look like it was intentional. Yeah, on the belt line. Also a veteran move. They're both playing it. Three and all, Tyrell Washington. Absolutely. See, that's all you had to do, man, in the beginning of the fight. Just keep him out of range. For Solis, on the chin as he's showing it. He's been in these battles before. And that's what you learn when you're a four-rounder, you're starting off, you're running different styles, different approaches. And you're going to get more resistance from different fighters. He needed this fight to man, in order to grow. We'll see if he escaped from this fight. I think he lost the first two. A lot of pushing from Tyrell Washington. How much boxing from the left behind? Not that much. He's just uh, covering up right now. I feel like he's wasting his gas tank, so now he's just trying to survive and keep him out of bed. Good jab from the lefty. This guy's at least his game, man. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you, 4 7 to 1, you gotta know, like, okay, he's 4 7 to 1 and 23, okay. Yeah, this is different. Less than a minute to go in the fight. A good opening bout, Marv Nation here in Pico Rivera, California. Ooh, good left hand. That's another good shot. Hand. Twenty-nine-year-old Tyrell Washington. A club show, and he pushes him down. I think Guillermo Solis, loving boy, shaking his head, and his corner is telling him, "Go, go, go, go." They know that they're on foreign soil. Final seconds. He's got better gear. Look at that. Look at that ring. Hey, hey, hey. Is it not, 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 not. Oh, whoa, Damn. my bad. Albert Baker under the hand ramps. This camera costs 40 grand. <laughs> the camera's facing out. All right. All right, fans, after four rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards. All three judges see the bout the same. 39, 37 for your winner. And still undefeated from the LBC, Tyrell Dirtyland Washington. 39-37, according to the judges, Tyrell Washington improves the four and O. Rodrigo Solis walks out shaking his head. Um, Jojo, you and I, I think we had a draw for this one, uh, but you can. Hey, that's the first bout of the night. Uh, we have eight more to go. Next one coming up is Greg Wilkerson, Carlos Rodriguez. Lee Groves checking in. What's up, Lee? In West Virginia, says hello to JoJo. What's up? What up? What up, man? All right, see that dude right there with the, the, the cowboy hat? Yeah. They're crushing him on YouTube. They're saying, is that my cousin? Did he fix his perm? <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, I guess his name is Charlie. What is my cousin wearing?